So today I'm giving Dean um, a taste of butternut squash for the first time and I put parsley in there as well for him. Um, he had a little bite of the butternut squash but I don't know if he really liked it or not. Now he's going into his little um, cave, his little man cave and he's eating some hay because he's got lots of hay in there. Um, I cleaned his hutch out and I sprayed it with his um, antibacterial spray and everything today and he just made a mess again basically. But I'm really, really um, loving this butternut squash that I'm making um, butternut squash soup with today. And so I thought I'd just give him some bits of that as well. He's eating the parsley as well. He's had quite a bit of parsley. I'm not sure that he's... He's never had parsley or butternut squash before, so I'm not sure he's quite accustomed to it. So that's why it might take him a bit of time to get accustomed to the taste of butternut squash and parsley. So we'll see how it goes. I'll, I'll keep monitoring him and his progress on this new food that I've introduced him to. And I think if he likes it later on he'll be eating a bit more. If not, I'm just going to give him something else that he really likes. Isn't that right, Mr Piggy? He's actually made a hole, like a really huge hole on the side. I made a small hole for him to like jump in and out of so he can get into his litter box. But he's made a giant hole and he keeps ripping away at it in anger and frustration from time to time. And so that's what his hutch looks like at the moment. His indoor hutch, his outdoor hutch is huge. Hello. Oh, we want to go back inside? Eat some more hay? Looks super cute, Dean. I think he missed the hay. After eating all that parsley. So he's come to ask for some different types of food. Now he's drinking his water. Let's see if he eats this now. Go on, Dean. Be a good boy. Be a good boy. Go on. Deanie. So I'm just going to let him decide when he wants to eat. He always does this, has a huff and a puff, like when he gets in, because he's a bit upset that he had to come inside, but I can't leave him outside because the foxes will eat him. And he'll just eat in his own time. He always does this, so... I don't really know right now if he likes the butternut squash or not because he's too busy telling me that he's pissed off that I brought him in. Only time will tell. I'll check up on him later.